I'm Faith, your student government vice president and a member of the school leadership team and a member of the school safety team and a GLOW mentor. And I'm done. Throughout my seven years at this school, I've sat in countless hours of meetings analyzing the data you guys provide and using it to adjust our school culture. Yeah, bet you didn't know that we can look at that. I've seen some inconsistencies in the data of the New York City School Survey. How can we properly fix the school if we're getting inaccurate data? But don't you guys worry, I got you. Here are some do's and do nots when filling out the New York City School Survey. Do not select one option to speed through the survey. That makes the data skew to one side and it's generally not the favorable side. Plus, your teacher gives you a lot of time to complete the survey, so no rush. Do, take your time to ensure that the data is accurate and consistent. Do not online shop when filling out the survey. I promise that sale will still be on when you get home. Do, ask your teacher if you do not understand a question. Most of the time, the questions are worded weirdly and it can mislead some students. We wouldn't want you to be confused and misinterpret the question. Just ask for help. Do not text or speak to others instead of taking the survey. Not only are you being distracted, you are distracting others. Like someone famous said, don't be rude. Know your OSIS number. You'll need it to log in. P.S. If you haven't memorized your OSIS number, please do so. You will need it many, many, many times in your future ahead. Do not base your answers on a single teacher. Rather, base them on the whole school. The biggest misconception is that this survey is for the teacher who handed it to you. This is not a platform to express your discontentment for a teacher. Do not take a nap during the survey. I really hope this is self-explanatory for our bright scholars. Do throw out the survey paper in the right trash once you are done. Every class has a green bin for paper. Throw it there, not stuffed on the floor, not stuffed in the desk, not to be paper balls thrown at each other, the bin. Shout out, green team. Hi, everyone. I'm Surya, your student government president. Finally, do read the questions carefully and please take your time because we truly want to use this information to analyze and help our school community. As a student representative of the Department of Education, District 27, Community Education Council, student representative on the school leadership team, and a member of the school safety team, I have seen the importance of the school survey data as I, along with these teams, analyze this data to create change that is supposed to benefit students. The more accurate the data, the better we can create change that reflects the needs of our student body. Hopefully this video has taught each of you CBOs the correct way to take the New York City student survey. If you have any questions at all, any questions, feel free to just rewatch the video.